everybody. It's Lisa from Joyfully Art. Gonna make another video today. Okay, first off, here's my video, or my video. Here's my painting from my last video. The red took over. There's the coral, and you can see some of the blue, but it's mostly red. Got some really big cells because I used the hair serum, the coconut hair serum. So it's nice. I really like it. Okay, so on with the next. Today I'm working on a 12 by 16 canvas. Some skunk on it. I'm going to be doing a wandering ring pour. Haven't done one for a really, really long time. So I hope it turns out good. There's my cup I'm going to be pouring my paints into. So let's just get started. Get that paper towel real quick. After you shake these and then open them, they like to spurt out on you. Don't like that happening. Makes a big mess. I will have my colors listed. Um, in the description box below my video. Try and layer them the best that I can. Keep them in sequence. those wear. Can't remember for anything what came next. Oh well, I guess it doesn't really matter, does it? They're all gonna go on the canvas. They're all bright and beautiful colors. the colors I chose. Those are really pretty. Lots of air bubbles from shaking them. Go. Now I made this up to have so it will be the it around the yeah traveling ring so it will flow the paints will flow better and this is old gold I do know that I'm just gonna make a ring around it on the corners here and then if any cells pop up 
Maybe they'll be cold. Let me grab my spreader real quick. There we go. Spread this out. So flow right over it. that. Wipe this off a little bit. There. All right, are we ready? Let's tilt. See what happens. Or what doesn't happen. <laughs> that could be it too. But we want to keep what we don't want to keep. Got my TV on today, so hopefully I'll keep you in um, screen better this time. Let's go this way. One second. I think I see a glob in my paint and I want to get it while well, I notice it or I'll forget and then I'll have a glob in my paint. Oh, that's a big glob. That's terrible. Glad I saw that. And the hair on my hand. Don't want to do that either. We were going this way, weren't we? One more corner to go. I hope I have enough paint. It's going slowly, but I think it's going to make it. Oh, I think it made it. How's that? Let's put that back. All right. Let's see. Oh. Okay. Let's see if how it is. I think I'm going to try and tip it a little bit this way, a little bit more. I'm not crazy about that corner up here, see if we can get a little bit more of that green off of that corner. There we go. Oh, see, some of the gold is coming up in cells down here. I just stretched it too far. Let's see what happens if we go back a little bit. I want to make sure that everything's covered nicely. That we're not overextending ourselves anywhere. Hmm. Let me just do 
on my edges. I think they're all colored now. Not totally sure. But I can take care of that afterwards, I think. something else in there. Let's see. What's wrong with my paints today? Ooh, that's slippery. I don't know what's wrong with my paints today. Got another glob. Let me dry my hands. Get my hands wiped off for you. Don't drop anything. They're slippery. Okay, let's give it a torch. You can still see my rings. And there we have it. Remember, I work with all acrylic paints. And I think that's good to go. I hope you enjoyed watching me today. Let me give you a close-up. Those cells are coming up gold. So I used the old gold for, for um, the flow extender. Get this wiped off so that it won't take down my design. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Leave me a comment if you so desire. All my information, if you want to get in contact with me, is in the description box below. I think that's all that I have for you today. Share with your family and friends. Give me a thumbs up. It sure does help me with YouTube and my placement where they um, show my videos. I thank you all greatly. And as always, please have a great day.